Well, new message, stay home. Not every day, it's just a message doctors and probably your coworkers would like you to follow if you go to work and you're sick. Now, I am guilty of this. I've done it before, Adrian will tell you. I don't like calling in sick, no matter what. But I learned today, and I knew, it's not always best for the people who work near me. Here's Adrian with the story. For some people, it's the internal debate. I'm scheduled to work, but I don't feel good. Should I call in sick? That's tricky about the cold and flu season. People do sometimes ask me, should I go to work? But Doc, why does everything have to be so complicated? A recent survey shows 78% of the people who participated say they feel pressure to keep working, even when they feel under the weather. Should people stay home? We asked Dr. Sam Hansen Willis with the Greenway Clinic in St. Louis Park. It's rare now for us to quarantine colds. Um, Work exceptions might be if you work in a hospital or a childcare facility, there can be rules about returning to work when you're sick. But the decision is, is complicated. It's your income, it's your family. The survey also showed 42% of workers feel stressed when they attempt to call out sick. That is definitely something I hear from, from patients. Certain work environments can be harder to communicate to your coworkers and colleagues. I certainly do write notes for patients um, explaining and, and helping them communicate to their employers and their work environment saying, this patient really does need to stay home and take care of themselves. And doing so actually helps you get better quicker. It helps keep your coworkers from getting sick and their families, and it, it really does help to take that time to rest and heal. Let's say you have pneumonia, should you show up to work? Well, when you say pneumonia to a doctor, I think about um, a bacterial infection in the lungs themselves, and that can really uh, keep you run down and require rest and antibiotics um, if it's bacterial. And pneumonia is probably gonna keep you from being at work. It, it really can make you feel pretty lousy. If you have a fever as an adult of 103, 104, it's a good question to ask, why do I have that fever? If you're in a work environment where the health of those that you're around would be compromised by getting sick. That's something you want to think about before going to work with a fever 103, 104. The question of do I go to work is different than do I go to the doctor. Do you think our bosses should be better leaders and maybe take time off if they don't feel well? Bosses set the tone for what's acceptable in a work environment. If you want to demonstrate taking care of yourself and the community around you, doing that for yourself shows your, your employees that that's important.